good afternoon ma'am yeah good afternoon your resume your name anna pretty kalyani ma'am okay kalyani how are you yeah ma'am i'm fine how are you ma'am yeah i'm fine thank you Introduce yourself, Kalyani. Sure, ma'am. Myself, Anna Pretty Kalyani. I, I have completed my BCom Computer Application in 2022 with the passed aggregate percentage of 8.53 at Siddhartha Women's Degree College in Kukkapalli, Hyderabad. Uh, I am from Pekashan District, Gidharul, Andhra Pradesh, but currently staying in Hyderabad. We are the four members in a family. My father, he is a retired army, but he is working in uh, ESI Hospital is a, uh, as a supervisor. My mother, she is a housewife. My uh, sister, she has completed her post graduate graduation in 2021 and coming to my final year project is nothing but a uh, news video seats it is about all the farmers why they show more interest to buy the only news video seats uh, that's all about my academic year project and coming to my technical skills server and uh, manual testing uh, and coming to my hobbies my cooking i am interested to do cooking and uh, interest in dancing also and my short term goal is to get a job in a reputed company uh, and uh, be a become financially independent so that I can support to my parents. My long term goal is to get a a good position in a company. So what are your technical skills, Kalyani? My technical skills are code Java and manual testing, madam. Okay, so can you explain the OOPS concept in Java? Yeah, sure, ma'am. Uh, OOPS concept is nothing but object oriented programming language. Uh, basically, OOPS concept is divided into four types. Uh, First one is nothing but abstraction, inheritance, encapsulation, and polymorphism. Abstraction is nothing but is a mechanism of hiding the implementation code and displaying the essential features. It is nothing but abstraction. Basically, abstraction has some advantages. Uh, the main advantage of the abstraction is nothing but uh, core security. Uh, this, that is uh, about the abstraction. Okay. Overriding and method overloading. Uh, firstly, method overloading is nothing but in a class two or more methods having same name but they are different in input parameters. It is nothing but method overloading. Uh, method overriding is nothing but redefining the functionality of super class in subclass. It is nothing but method overriding. Okay. Uh, what are arrays? Uh, array. Uh, array is a predefined structure of uh, similar data and it is used to store fixed data it is nothing but array okay what are array types uh, basically array is divided into two types so dynamic array static array uh, uh, dynamic array dynamic array is nothing but directly by giving values is known as dynamic array static array is nothing but uh, by giving the size it is known as the static array uh, what is command line argument okay the command line argument is nothing but passing the lines uh, during the ja running java program okay, okay. Uh, what are constructors uh, types of constructor is divided into two types default constructor and parameterized constructor default constructor is nothing but the constructor which are, does not contain any input parameter is known as default constructor and, uh, and coming to uh, parameterized constructor is nothing but the which are contain input parameters is uh, what is class variable and local variable? Okay, class variable is nothing but the de uh, declaring the variables inside the class uh, but outside the method is known as class variable. Local variable is uh, declaring the variables inside the method is known as local variable. Okay, uh, what is package and uh, its types? Uh, packages. It is a group of similar types of uh, classes and interfaces is known as packages. And the types are user defined package and predefined package. User defined package is created by the Sun Micro systems is known as user defined package. Predefined package is nothing but the creating by the developers is known as uh, predefined package. Okay, what is, uh, what is final? Uh, final is a keyword in Java. It can be used for the methods, classes, and variables. If we use final keyword for the methods, we, we cannot uh, overwrite the method. If we use final keyword for the classes, we cannot inherit the, the class. If we use final keyword for the uh, variables, we cannot reassign the values. Okay, uh, what is abstraction? Uh, abstraction, it is, a it is a mechanism of hiding the implementation code and displaying the essential fuser is known as abstraction. The main advantage of the, of the abstraction is a code security. Okay, uh, what is abstraction method? Uh, abstract method is nothing but the, it contains a method signature and which it does not contain a method definition is known as abstract method. Okay, uh, what is exception handling? Uh, exception handling, the process of handling the exception is known as exception handling. 
What is exception? Uh, the unwanted and unexpected situation in an application is known as exception. Uh, basically, exception types is divided into two types, uh, checkered exception and unchecked exception. The exceptions which are handled during compile time is known as checkered exception. Unchecked exceptions, the checkered and the ch exceptions which are handled during runtime is known as unchecked exceptions. Okay. Uh, okay, Kalyani. So, as of now, we are done with this round. Okay. okay so, you will be getting the, the call. Okay. Okay. Okay, we will get back to you, okay? Thank you.